reactor online sensors online weapons online all systems nominal Okay, so here we are doing um, a user-submitted ride-along, <coughs> user-submitted build ride-along, and we will be dissecting Moonsword's Death Snell, the Moonsword variant. Uh, he's got three medium lasers, two in the left arm, one in the right arm, one large laser, an XL210 engine, which is about as, about as big as you can shoehorn in here. Gets me up to 136 kilometers per hour before speed tweak, uh, 10 double heat sinks, 8 in the engine, 2 in the right and left torsos. No jump jets, sadly. No AMS, nothing like that. Armor values are stock. Heat efficiency is 1.23. Mm, not very good, but we can compensate with a little bit of cool shot. Firepower is 24, which surprisingly for a mech this size is not all that bad. Plus, the large laser has a decent range. So, without further ado, we will drop and see how we do. All right, so we're in the Moon Sword variant. Uh, this mech has three medium lasers and one large laser. It's got an XL210 in it, which is the biggest you can shoehorn in here. Um, Reactor. I've got online. no pilot tree experience point Sensors upgrades or anything online. like that on this mech yet. Weapons it is uh, bone stock in terms of that. All systems but uh, double heat sinks, endo steel, ferrofibrous armor, and I did stick some cool shot on here um, because I would imagine this thing would run a little hot. But let's give it a whirl and see how things work out. Tell you this much though, I certainly feel tiny in this little thing. engage and then I can try and pick guys off since I'm not really built for a scouting role. I just said I'm not built for a scouting role, and here I am scouting. Bear in mind that this is a complete pub drop. Uh, I'm not a part of any team. I don't know any of these guys. Well, I think I know Doug Cruz. Acquired. All on the three line. Not exactly sure about oh, new target go. acquired. Hell no. New target acquired. <laughs> New target acquired. Warning incoming missile. Stick and move, stick and move. 
Got the gas pedal thing uh, engaged still. That's dumb. I'll have to turn that off. Target acquired. Oh, one more large laser, and I think that one would have been mine. Well, two kills, uh, however many assists. And let's see the damage that I did. 504 damage, two kills, four assists in the death snail. You know what? I will take that any day of the week. There you go, Moonsword. You saw me running around. <laughs> All right. Well, that was, <laughs> that was interesting. Um, two kills, over 500 points of damage. Not bad. Uh, this mech doesn't really have a specific role other than a harasser. I mean, you don't have jump jets, you don't have tag, you don't have um, Beagle Active Probe, you don't have ECM, anything like that. So basically your job is to run around and harass people, assist with caps, maybe assist the guy who is running electronic warfare or whatever. It'd be great for light lances or if you really want to be suicidal, an entire light company. But um, with the max speed getting over 142, I believe, with speed tweak, uh, your heat efficiency is a little low, but I'm sure that would be boosted with, uh, you know, your cool run and heat efficiency and all that kind of stuff. Kind of fun. I don't know if I would want to take this into a competitive match, at least not with some without some more serious training in it. Uh, I've only dropped in it a couple of times total, so... Mm, overall, I would give this uh, probably a good four-star rating. It was fun to play. It was different. It doesn't necessarily suit my role and play style. However, uh, I would step into it again for sure. There you have it. We hope you enjoyed this. Mechspecs.com, user-submitted build, ride-along, and dissection. If you guys want to see others of this type, please feel free to join Mechspecs.com, register there, and submit whatever user build you think would be appropriate. We'll take a look, and if we like it, we'll run it. 